Greetings, I am Harry Larry from Gary, and this is episode 2087 of uh, The Sims 4 Gallery Lots, and this particular lot is called Thanksgiving at Grandma's. It is on a 20 by 20, a lot type residential, and quite a bit of description here. Oh, there's more welcome to read. And hopefully you did. Let me get to these photos here. Try to and see if it does a lot justice or not. No. But the first one does. So, let's go take a look. Oh, that looks kind of cool. I like the look of it. And it would go well on a 20 by 20 lot. That looks cool as well. All right, let's flip to the other side. We'll go down, we'll look around. After I even up, of course. There. Oh, I'm glad it's not too far into fall, so we can actually see those flowers in bloom anyways, or at least the real color. All right, let's get that forward look. We'll dive right on in. Huh? Looks pretty much like the first photo. That's cool. All right, let's go on in. And I did press play to see if these things are bubblers or not, so they must be lights. Because I didn't see no water coming out of the top. Take a peek over here. So maybe we will go to a build mode at the end. And I'll turn it to nighttime just so we can see what it looks like. If it looks phenomenally pretty or not. Definitely a pretty front lawn. All right, are you ready to go in? I am. Well, that looks magical. Anything on the front stoop? No. All right, let's go on in. Scooch back a little bit. Not too bad of a front stoop. Let us go on in. And before I forget, everything here is playable. There's nothing I found that needed to be fixed. So that is always a cool thing. Definitely nice grandma colored chairs 
I was really kind of worried about if they were going to be able to sit on that couch because of the coffee table, but it worked out. Let's get a corner shot. Try to, anyways. Not doing too well at it. I like the little octopus on the couch. All right, let's go take a look at this kitchen. Yeah, that looks really nice to me. Super cool. Beautiful kitchen. Nice living room. We'll take a look at the dining room here in a moment. Perfect clock. All right, and one of the best things, you do get the seven course meal on here. And they don't expire for a long time. Of course, Blondie's eating the spaghetti that she made just to make sure the kitchen works, of course. Yeah, I was super happy when I noticed there's actually a, a full data right there. And the mismatched chairs just to make sure the whole family has somewhere to sit, which is also a thing I always enjoy looking for. Hi, Blondie. All right, we're gonna go through this door. And it's grandma's uh, bedroom. Yes, I do notice the plants coming through the walls. If that bothers you, just go outside and move them off a little bit. All depends on how you wanna use this if you download it yourself. I like grandma's purse right there. That looks like a grandma's purse. But it's not the grandma that actually has butterscotch. She would be the one that would have the peppermint. Okay. Just wanted to see what type of plant life was coming through. Yeah, definitely peppermint in that uh, purse. I prefer the butterscotch. And of course, yes, I am waving. You're always more welcome to wave back. Or not. But I always hope you do. This is a lovely little bedroom, lovely little house. Did you notice what was missing? All right, we're going to go through this door. Wonder if you noticed. And we got a nice little walking path back here. And where does this walking path walk to? Well, I'll show you. To the laundry area. We'll come back to the shed here in a moment. Just want to show this off. A 
Oh, I see lagers. It is a bathroom. Well, actually, it's an outhouse. Oh, and we do got loo paper. All right, Lars. That's super cool. I noticed that would host right away, but, pardon me for a sec, but I did not notice there was no bathroom in the house right away. It took me a little bit going around thinking, huh, this is missing something. Figure it out. All right. As always, we'll take a closer look at this build. And if you ended up enjoying this lot and or video, you're always more welcome to give this video a thumbs up. That helps my channel out greatly. It would be greatly appreciative if you did. If you, I like that look right there. If you find yourself enjoying my content as well, and you're not a subscriber, well, you're always more than welcome to subscribe. And of course, lovely rope line. If you do subscribe, don't forget to hit that notification button and doorbell. We'll take a little closer look at the outhouse. To those of you who already are my subscribers, well, thank you very kindly. Always greatly appreciated. Hopefully I keep on making content that you enjoy watching. Yeah, beautiful little cottage. If you have anything to say, you're always more than welcome to put it in the comment section. I always enjoy reading those and answering when I can. If you know anybody who would like to see this lot in video form, you're always more than welcome to share this video. And of course, the most important thing of all, please take a look at this creator's other creations. And they have a lot of beautiful lots, I can tell by the photos, and a lot of rooms too. Those on uh, Maxis lots, I mean, uh, gallery lots, gallery rooms, pardon. I'll do a couple of theirs because there was a lot of nice ones I'd liked. Definitely that Halloween one they did. I can't remember what it's called now. In the description, it was about uh, spiders attacking you if you don't fill up the kettle bucket. Anyways, and they got lots and lots of people. So highly recommend. Go take a look. And as you can see, no problem whatsoever for the ceiling, ceilings. That was easy for me to say. Yeah, that it was so cool seeing the whole dinner right there.
beautiful lot all the way around, and there is no basement. So let's see if I can find a good angle to make a perfect thumbnail of this place. Ooh, that looks pretty cool. Yeah, I kind of dig that. All right, we're going to go with that. So hopefully I'll catch you on the next episode. And until then, later.